Chamberlain. It costs not much. Same price as the Craftman, which I just bought, just put up. That wouldn't go past the door with the door closed at all. So we're gonna try this one. See what we get inside. Do our best to unpack it. And here we are. It resembles the same exact thing as the Craftsman half horsepower and just a less couple of things. Identical 100%. So what I am going to do is rather hook this up. I'm going to lay it on the floor. I'm going to step outside and I'm going to listen to see if this will run with the wireless remote control, the issues I had before. It's identical, 100%. I'm not even sure if I even want to do Craftsman Chamberlain anymore. What is the better door opener on the market? I don't know, but this is what we're stuck with at our local hardware store on an emergency. The main unit, replaceable sprocket, instructions, the chain and wire, the sensors that light up orange and green that will brighten up your garage at nighttime, optional keypad, another doorbell, a doorbell that don't have a light that we need to have a light switch, the remote control, all the hardware with the pulley, all the pieces that you need, the cutler pins and all, the sensor brackets, which I don't use, the wire for the doorbell, the brackets and the arms, which I already have set up, and the top piece to hold the arm that I got set up that I will supply myself with those, and the arm over there, and the three prong plug. Single light only, very simple to hook up, an hour later will be installed or so. <laughs> important part is putting a screwdriver getting this nice and tight the correct way and everything else will line up perfectly when you install the rest <music> works just fine before you do any more work because the hard part is over and the fun begins how are you gonna lift this up by yourself well you see I got one rope laid out in a couple of places and I gotta get a cutler pin all the way up here Right there, my garage can hold things up for me as well. I get it up and I lift it up, rope it up, garage it up. I wish I could show you that. I'm one man, no friend, no good neighbors, do everything with the rope.
optional keypad I'll put outside soon. And the one that's given has a light switch on top. I don't love it, but we like it. Where I want my sensors because I got junk that just falls in front of the garage. Everything's secured except for the side bolts. We'll finish that up and close the door. You're supposed to have some slack. That's what I hate about these systems. My track's supposed to be over here. Well, when I lock it back, everything will fall into place. Hope I won't be in your way. I'll have to still tidy up some things. This is where I get power. Acknowledgement. Beautiful. Up. Down. Center. Like I said. It's just going to drive you crazy. Trust me. So we're going to hit the down. Up. Now we're ready to go. It's telling you to hit the up button. Go all the way up to where you want it to lock into place the height you want. Stop. I'm happy with that height. Enter. Hit the down button. When it hits the floor down, you're going to stop. And then hit the enter, and you're all set. Carefully pay attention to let go when it stops. Don't want it too tight. Perfect! It automatically goes by itself. It's going to learn the system. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. It's doing it automatically. It's a robot. It's programmed to do its job. Three beeps completed. Your remote control. Perfect, man. I don't love when things make noises like that. Maybe my chain needs to be loosened up just a little bit. Yellow, green, breaks the connection. And it stop. I'm gonna finish up. I need this screw. <laughs> yeah. Put in my screw. I'm gonna close my door. See if it opens. See how good it works. In a minute. Chamberlain, you made a customer. Craftsman, you lost the customer. Well, that's Chamberlain for you. It works better than an old fashioned Craftsman, which is outdated. Be very careful of these antennas. They are the worst antennas in the world on the Craftsman. At least my garage door now works. Time to clean up my install. Oh man, this. It's just way too close to my light. I wonder what happened here. I'm going to have to relearn this system all over again. So let me uh, get rid of this 
and put it up a little bit better, shorten this arm. This arm is a little too long for this store. Maybe I put the arm on wrong, I don't know. I never know, it was the same arm. I don't think it goes the other way. On that note, you all know, have a great day and I hope you enjoyed this unconventional install. Have a great day everybody.